Hello, I'm Dieter Janssen and I want to present you the coordinate system updater plugin that I've built. The best way to do this is to close this project and open a new project that has still a problem that needs to be solved. I open this project and you will see that two map layers are loaded, having two different coordinate systems. The map layer with the Dutch coordinate system does not overlay correctly with the coordinate system used by Google Maps. This coordinate shift of more than 100 meters also occurs when loading map data that uses the WGS84 coordinate system like your recorded GPS tracks or waypoints. Now let's start the plugin and uh, I will choose to upgrade only the Amersfoort RD new the Dutch coordinate system. When I will do that, you will see that uh, it will improve the situation. I will restart Quantum Kiss. And now we will see that the layers are overlaid correctly. Instead of the Google Streets layer, I will turn on the Google Hybrids layer. Now let's zoom in on a section of the map to get an idea of the precision of uh, mixing those two coordinate systems. And that looks pretty good. To see how this is achieved, we are going to look more closely at the layer with the changed coordinate system. This layer, which is a vector map, in the XF format, uses the coordinate system I have just updated. The parameter 2WGS is responsible for the correct presentation of this layer when used together with other layers using the WGS84 coordinate system. The list showing the coordinate systems available for update uses colors to show the status for each coordinate system. The items in blue are the only coordinate systems that can be updated. Light green items do not need an update. Dark green items have been updated. They are the only coordinate systems that can be restored to the original settings. When I press the restore button, the color of the item will turn blue again. And I will get a message. That I'll have to restart Quantum Kiss, which is what we will do. Restarting this project, we will see that the problem exists again, which is great because you can always go back to the original settings. A warning use only one coordinate system for raster layers. When using more, the on-the-fly CRS transformation will fail. I am sure this will be fixed in a future release of Quantum Kiss. Thank you for watching.